Shalom everyone, I hope that you are doing absolutely fantastic. Today is the 15th of January, 2020. Uh, happy birthday, happy anniversary, all that good stuff. Uh, if you are brand spanking new on this channel, welcome. It's real talk here. We don't hold back on anything. Uh, I am not religious or churchy. I am spiritual. I have an awakening. I don't put the spirit in a box because we could never do that. I am connecting with Jehovah Elohim, maker of heaven and earth, and uh, I'm not ashamed of him. He is beautiful. I uh, prove how he's found in the tarot, and his name is here, and everything else. So if you want to watch that video, it's down below. Um, but uh, I feel the energy, so if you are new, it's, like I said, it's real talk here. Sometimes it's very forceful at times coming out. Uh, of my spirit. It's just that Jehovah is addressing something that he's wanting to address. So anyway, uh, just uh, to say um, anyone who thinks that they're going to take the work of my hands on this video and cut and slice anything uh, for your gain, a curse will go to your home. That is uh, what is written in the scripture. So uh, you're considered a thief and a liar. My name is Shannon and this is the work of uh, Jehovah Elohim on this channel that I am yielded to. So you'll have to take it up with him. When he brings a curse to your home, it will abide there. Okay, so anyway, I just wanted to say that. Uh, that's what scripture says and scripture don't lie. So anyway, let's get started guys and see what's going on. I'm a little later getting on this morning because I've been doing work and stuff like that in my home. It's snowing here in Kansas City and I love the snow. Uh, it relates us back to uh, mercy and stuff like that. It snowed the very first day of January as well. So this is the second snow of the year that we're getting here. So anyway, I love it. I'm a winner baby anyway. <laughs> Jehovah Elohim, I just appreciate you so very much. Uh, Jehovah, rebuke and bind and block every foul, demonic, wicked, dark energy, every familiar spirit, every witchcraft, demonic thing. Jehovah, rebuke you straight down to the pit where you will remain. Jehovah, what do you want to bring out here today? I just thank you for this day, and I thank you uh, for the highest vibration of them all, and that's love. I thank you for forgiveness. Thank you, Jehovah. All right, well, we got several. I'm just going to take the top and the bottom, and then I'll take some more off of that. So we do have stubbornness going on, but that's ten pentacles. There's a lot of pentacles here. Uh, the ten of pentacles card represents large sums of money, as we know, and um, inheritances and things like that. And a lot of people are also trying to hang on to what they have as well. But this is a greedy card. Mine! type of energy is being shown here and if you stole it it ain't yours because somebody's getting the scales over their head okay something that's taking place some of y'all have gone through divorces and now you're having to try to secure something I send you love and light this is a generosity card though and if somebody's not wanting to do that or they've done something that's jail worthy then they'll just be sitting there all the time for stealing something and doing that kind of business or whatever that is uh, show me the four of uh, pentacles, please. What's this four of pentacles here for you, Hova? So we have earth and air. We have Libra and Capricorn, Taurus and Virgo. And as we know, the sun is in Capricorn right now. It could be anybody. And no normally I don't say that. Not always. Um, just because we find all this in our chart anyway. But for whatever reason, that might be prevalent for someone since it's coming out. What's this four of pentacles here for? Thank you. Um, temperance is here. And this is obviously somebody's, this is about reconciling. If somebody didn't want to open up to reconcile uh, where family matters were concerned, this is the letter noon in the Hebrew. So if you are new, like I said, I use the living language and scripture in my, on my channel and in my readings. And this would be the letter N, which is the letter noon in the Hebraic uh, living language. And it has a lot of different meanings to it. It's the pictograph of the... Um, Sperm. So if somebody got pregnant or something, we've been seeing a lot of pregnancy stuff. Then we did this go back to children. It's uh, heirs to kingdoms. Eternity is here. We got death issues and going on. Let's said the ten of ten pentacles goes back to inheritances. Um, we've got a river type of energy here. There's a prophet. This is spirituality. It could be a teaching energy. Travel is here with this house. Um, your higher mind is here. There's balancing. Um, the scales are here as well. So we got you know 
balancing uh, situations going on. People trying to get grounded within some stuff. Um, so this this is clear. The, the um, noon is clarifying the four pentacles about getting grounded and something about returning. Somebody's just been greedy about returning, probably because there is some type of uh, death issue around the situation with family. This is the husband. This is protection. Somebody. This is also a protection card. Somebody's trying to protect something. What are they trying to protect? You have, what, what do you say they're trying to protect? What is it? Because there's fortune here with the ninth house on that. And again, there's large sums of money. And so this is this is a inheritance card as well. And there's a lot of money here. There's a lot of money being shown here. Um, so they're trying to protect projects probably this is the lower version of the empress this is something this is somebody single as well somebody's got somebody uh, pregnant as well and they're trying to protect them this is somebody who's been put in a garden and been used for some people somebody getting the scales over their head for doing that crap that's why somebody won't open up because they know what they've done or they've held on to some inheritances for some of you all um but this high discernment and your higher mind is here and somebody hasn't been balanced and they're trying to get their balance because if they have to secure something, then that's what's showing. Well, we already know it, people. We already know it. Show me this. It, you know, this is a generosity card. Why wouldn't you be generous? Well, because you're greedy. Somebody is. And there's a bunch of crap around it. Show me the Six of Pentacles. Show me the Six of Pentacles here, please. The Two of Cups is here. Okay, well, opening up and, and being kind. This is, go back to soulmates and stuff like that. There's deception, though, around something. This is also unity. It's a unity card. Something about the mother is here. Something about the husband is here for some of you all. And um, there's deception around something. Let's just take some... Um, that's hunting and chasing stuff. Let's just take some words from my Hebraic deck. You hope you just pick it, please. So there is a victory. The moon and the um, the fourth house and the ninth house together make the chariot card. Okay, there is a victory here, and there's blessings and abundance and riches. We were told today that we were going to get money today. Okay, something has been decided or something today about that. It's it's coming, people. It is coming. That's traveling type of energy, so it's on its way. There's a lump here. Well. <laughs> There is a lump, and there has been something that has been set apart and it's caused people to have to uh, sit there and try to, you know, figure out what to do because somebody else has been um, greedy with some crap here. But there, there has been something that set, that's been set apart for somebody in the family, uh, inheritances, and somebody stole the crap around it. And uh, you hope it's going to bring a victory out of it. So this is to encircle or to surround. There's a chamber energy here, walls. And we got that yesterday, people. We really got that yesterday. There's a plate. There's a hidden. Something's been hidden behind walls as well. That keeps coming out. That keeps coming out. Engraving energy here. Somebody's engraved something. There's a pen. There's markings. There's an inscription of some sort here as well. Um, something is complete. Something's over. Something's come to an end, and that's positive because there's a victory here. There's the miser for the word in the Hebrew, the MSR, and we got the miser card. That's come out before on the channel like that, but this is this is going back to commit to something or to unite or to deliver something. Oh, there's united energy here. And uh, so th we do have, you know, decisions around that. Somebody's going to be sitting in a prison cell for some of y'all because this is a law really big on somebody. Well, we already know it. Uh, the sickle. Somebody getting cut. There's a harvest here. There's also an accident and a verdict here as well. And so I guess it is, it is a verdict. Somebody's going to go straight to prison because we were told so this week for something that they did. The sickle goes back to, if somebody murdered somebody, I guess they did. Okay? That's death energy. Death energy is here. That's eternity. Okay? If somebody lied about something, then they did. Because there's been deception here. It's hunting and chasing crap. Yo, but what else you want to bring out here? Thank you. 
a, a judgment is here. This is the tet. Again, somebody's trying to store somebody up in clay. Something got really filthy. We got the letter T here. And um, the T and the TH, the ox is here as well. And the kisses and the hugs and the pictograph. Um, some could literally be in a basket. I'm not sure. But anyway, somebody made a false report on purpose. Well, we already know it. And, and it caused nothing but a freaking ruckus. And somebody can go on to prison for that. This is a world card at the bottom of the deck. Um, the tapestry word, I believe, is here with these two letters. Um, and somebody has only been shown one side of, of themselves. And there is another side. And here's the other side of the story is what I'm hearing. So, strength. And there's an H here as well. This is a courage to do something. This also takes us back to children. It talks, also takes us back to passing from one space to the next. New birth, new life. Okay, well, we got new life here as well going on. Um, yeah, there was a consequence and a choice that somebody made. Okay, well, whatever this is for today, there is a victory for somebody today. And then you got money coming to you. All right, it will be on its way because this, this is, you know, like the third video that I've done that you hope has brought that out. So let the person sit now in jail and uh, think about what they did for eternity, I guess, because what they did cost them because there's murder energy here. Shalom.